There it is. So tell me about this beautiful, uh, beautiful guitar. On yeah, well, it's a uh, classical guitar, but uh, an arch top guitar. Yes, same it's very yeah. unusual, isn't it? A hand carved top of no a, binding. No binding. Yeah. So this this chamfered edge sort of uh, deepens to sort of expose the inside of the guitar, and that becomes the sound port. Yeah. Like right. Yeah. So the idea is that uh, black walnut and uh, yeah, black fruit. walnut. Uh, See, oh, you Eastern told me yesterday. White Eastern White Cedar, I remember. Yeah, reclaimed remember now. Old yeah. Barn. And um, yeah, the structure of it is interesting. So, in order to maximize the soundboard area and to make it as light as possible, there's actually a, uh, a spine piece that runs. Oh yes, the guitar. right. Yeah. I remember now. Yeah. It's bolted there, and the tailpiece is bolted to it, and there's a stick that runs through there. Right. So the soundboard is super thin, about one and a half millimeters around the edges. Super and it's a very, very light guitar. I, I, I was lifting it yesterday. That's really uh, one of the lightest guitars I've ever seen. Yeah. But for a classical guitar, these nylon strings, you need to make it as light as you can. Yeah. Because the strings just don't have much mass. Exactly. They don't have that power, yeah. But uh, it worked out pretty well. well you may have inspired me to try uh, an arch top nylon string. All right, I hope so. You know, <laughs> see what you do. Yeah. Well, thanks a lot, Michael. You're welcome. Pleasure. Uh, and you're from where again? Ottawa. Ottawa, right, my old hometown. Uh, don't hold okay. Thank you very much, sir.